Hello, this is Dallin Anach, and I'll be going over my Enhancement 4 assignment. So we'll start off by going to the Products Management page by typing in the Products folder here. And it'll take me to this page. I have the Add Product and Add Category buttons here. So first we'll do Add Product. And if we type in some values here, I have the image and thumbnail set to the default. It's, uh, no image.png. Let's just add all these things. Um, the category has all the category names. Since the category ID, we'll choose explosive. And do that. Hit add. You'll get a success message here. And if we go to my inventory, you will see everything I did here. And these are going to show zero because they're supposed to be integers. So there's that. Go ahead and delete it. And if we um, if we leave everything blank here, you'll see it says there's an error submitting a request because I have these set to if any of them are null, it's not going to let you submit it. So let's go back. We'll go to add category. If you leave this blank as well, it's going to get the same error message. If we put in a category name, it'll go back here and you'll get the category here. As you can see, we can go to my database and check as well. We have a new category there. Go ahead and delete that. And you'll see it's gone now. Um, now we'll check the HTML CSS. So let's do CSS, no errors. HTML, no errors. On the product page. CSS, no errors, and HTML, no errors, and lastly on the category page, CSS, no errors, and HTML, no errors. And I believe that is all we have to show. Let me just double check. Alrighty, I think that's all um, we're supposed to display here, so uh, we'll conclude my video. Thank you.